Okay, welcome to the Martin Professional Boot uh, for a short introduction on the VC series. The VC series is a series of creative LED video elements, mainly for integrating video into stages, TV studios, or also fixed installations. In the VC series, we have grids like the VC Grid 25, but we also have a full range of dot products like our VC.1 up there integrated into the wall. Uh, we also have them in different size. We have a medium and a large uh, video dot as well. Uh, what we want to do with this series, because obviously integrating video in creative modules is not something new. What we want to do is, is focus on two main things. The first one being quality. Uh, as this series is fully calibrated, which means perfect color uniformity, but also for fixed installations going forward, you have a fixed installation, or two years later, some dots or some grids need replacement. You're not stuck with uh, different binning problems, color differences, because it's fully calibrated. Also, quality wise, we put inside every product here the full processing power of our video panels. So it's not a basic board or with LEDs driven by DMX, it's actually a miniature video panel. The second thing we've done is we made it much easier to work with. We stepped away from DMX because if you would do a product like this on DMX, well, two of those boards and one universe is gone, and then you're having really complicated setups. Uh, so we've dri we're driving this with P3 technology, which is Martin's video processing system, uh, which means that uh, you can actually have 12 of those units per daisy chain, which would be um, impossible with DMX, uh, involving less cabling, less power supplies, less converter boxes, because we don't have any actually. So we want to make the system much easier to set up. Uh, if you compare to some, some competing products here, they usually have a power supply that needs to sit right next to the module and then an adapter box and a driver box all needing to sit right next to the module. What we've done is we've put all the intelligence on the unit itself and we've developed a universal power module which is the power port uh, which sits on the network and then with 4-pin XLR you connect the grids and the dots and all future creative elements we'll be doing. The other thing we've done is that by using a special technology we enabled this power unit to be up to 50 meters away from all your creative elements which is a huge advantage in stage shows if you're integrating this into a drum riser or into a tv studio you don't need to hide anything like power supplies or driver boxes inside the creative element you can have a rack of the power units sitting backstage up to 50 meters away just making it that much easier uh, to get away with. Also, mapping-wise, getting video on this product is really straightforward because we treat this as a video product, not as a pixel map lighting product. So it's basically a question of just mapping it out on our P3 controller, as you see there, just very graphically, you drag the modules where they need to be, and the processor makes sure that every unit, every dot, every grid in this setup gets the right video information right away. So mapping this is extremely easy. Just a quick comparison. All the creative grids and dots we have here integrated, like the ones in the bar, the ones in those tablets, all of that, if you would drive that using conventional DMX technology, that would already have been 21 universes of DMX being wasted, involving uh, ArtNet nodes, involving media servers to get it all mapped out. Whereas for a P3 controller, it's actually peanuts. It's only 2,500 pixels for one controller and he can do half a million. So by going to uh, P3 video technology, we can get way more creative and way more powerful in uh, creative video integration. <laughs> Any specific questions? No, it is, this is a fixed uh, pitch of 25 millimeter, but because all the technology is in the power units and this is just a board, we can extremely easily make custom variants. We're also already talking with lighting designers and show designers for specific shows, uh, creating custom uh, pixel pitches, custom board dimension, even uh, triangles, squares, uh, hex hexagons, because all it's, it's a full system, you can just, everything relies on that power unit, so we can easily do custom stuff with this.